The first of two championship matches on the road to no regrets. Right now, the women's title about to be decided. champion, lost the women's title here in defiance to Millie McKenzie a couple of months ago. She's had one opportunity to win it back in an amazing triple threat match a couple of weeks ago at Lights Out. McKenzie retained the title in that match, but it was not Kaylee Ray who was pinned. Kaylee Ray still believes she's entitled to a rematch. Our general manager agreed, and that's led to this one-on-one -on -one match for the women's title. Decorated athlete like Kaylee Ray since she lost the title to this woman, the 20th, the first 21st century badass. It has been eating Kaylee Ray alive. The new dominant force in women's wrestling. Here she is. Her opponent. She is the current reign and defending the fine wrestling women's champion, the first 21st century. As you rightly say, James, the, uh, the sight of that women's title draped over the shoulder of Millie McKenzie deeply bothers Kaylee Ray. Kaylee Ray was the longest reigning well, women's champion in defiant history. Kaylee believing that that belt was her property and that there was every reason to believe, frankly, that she was going to hold on to it for a very long time until along came Millie McKenzie. Along came Millie. And uh, it's been said along came a spider. I don't think anyone can escape the web that Millie McKenzie has been weaving here in Defiant Wrestling. So, so impressive. However, when you talk about Kaylee Ray, you're talking about one of the best female wrestlers on the planet today. There's no reason to believe, there's no reason to doubt someone like Kaylee Ray with her credentials. Referee rings the bell. We are underway. McKenzie and Ray for the Defiant Women's Championship, a rematch. These women have had already some of the best battles in Defiant Wrestling to date. I have a hunch we're about to see another. Well, that triple threat at, at Lights Out was considered one of the greatest matches, not just from the women's division, but in the history of Defiant Wrestling. It's a quick pin attempt, small package from Kaylee Ray. Now Mackenzie tried to, that fireman's carry, instead there's a victory roll from Mackenzie. Both of these women oh. trying to put this away early. I'll <laughs> oh, talk about setting the tone for a match early. Both of these women can strike as hard as anyone. Big boot into the uh, midsection of the champion. And now hang on a second, an attempt, oh maybe at the Corey bomb. Instead it was uh, Mackenzie who nearly hit that trademark move of, of Kaylee Ray on Kaylee Ray. And now a standoff. I'm not sure Kaylee Ray has ever been in this position against someone who is such a good match for her like Millie McKenzie is. It's new terrain for someone like Kaylee Ray. McKenzie with those forearms to the face of the former champion who backed her into the ropes and, and Kaylee followed her in. Sammy Jane and Kaylee did everything in their power at Lights Out to try and wrestle the women's championship away from Millie McKenzie. Coming up short. Yeah, what a match. Remarkable match for all three women. McKenzie found a way, and that's the key thing. She keeps doing it. So many, less and less people on social media are doubting Millie McKenzie. Okay, when she won the championship, there were people saying, yes, she's young. It might well be a flash in the pan. One thing McKenzie's shown, it certainly is not yeah, a flash in the pan. I think that ship has long sailed. McKenzie is the real deal, no doubt about that. And Kaylee Ray trying to prove that she still is. Mackenzie, very much of the feel of the uh, new queen of the mountain here. Gonna try for one of those vicious German suplexes. Kaylee Ray will scratch, bite and claw her way to the top of that mountain, rest assured. Do everything in her power to become champion. Kaylee trying to send Mackenzie into the corner, and the end of the counter. And Mackenzie, that's a, that could be the first of many German yeah. suplexes. Get your calculator out, you might need it. Mackenzie rolls away, took too long. Uh, 
eats the boot of Kaylee Ray. Well, Kaylee Ray must surely have watched those previous matches, her previous shots against Millie McKenzie. Gonna go for the gory bomb. Going to go for the gory bomb here. Now, Kaylee Ray initially won the women's title. And a backdrop in the end. I think maybe McKenzie was looking for a power bomb. Whoever it was, Kaylee Ray countered it successfully. Hang on a second now. Oh. Kaylee looking for the submission. McKenzie is somewhat near to the uh, bottom rope, but with the wrong part of her body. Yeah, but we've seen Mella yeah. McKenzie use those long legs, stretch out, and cause the break on the submission. We've seen that before. If Kaylee Ray wants to get a submission on Mella McKenzie, it really has to be more central in the ring. Now she had to move her body around again there. Easier said than done, however. It's yeah. easy to sit here and judge. It's a different thing altogether to be in that ring competing. Kenzie, though, was able to get to the rope, so it's back to the drawing board here for Hayley Ray, who hits her opponent with a chop to the face. Mackenzie now fighting back. Oh, look at the strength. The octopus hold here, stretching that. Look at that, the position of that right arm of Kaylee Ray bent backwards. It's in a precarious position, Bradshaw. That arm could become dislocated or break at any moment. You see Kaylee Ray here having to use as much power as she can to prevent that right arm from becoming hyperextended. Power's the word. In the end though, Mackenzie ended up on her feet. I think Ray was possibly looking for the Samoan drop. Kaylee is angry now. Mackenzie though, unloading. Into the corner goes the former champion. Here comes the first 21st century badass. Everything Mackenzie does is about sending a message. Looking for a crucifix, maybe trying to turn her way around. Or hang on a second, though. Oh. Hang on a second, Kaylee Ray. What an innovative counter. There's the gory bomb. That could be it, Bradshaw. Kaylee Ray to regain the championship. And Mackenzie just got out. Mackenzie somehow finding a way that's been the hallmark of her defiant women's championship reign. Finds a way to escape every single time. Kaylee putting the boot in now to Mackenzie, gonna pick her up. Got to strike while the iron is hot. May have not got her with that gory bomb, but you can just continue this assault here, then possibly Kaylee Ray could be walking out of here in the next few moments with that women's title. Well, that's what it's all about, that championship goal. Are we gonna see another German? We might, but it might not be from Mackenzie. In fact, it's not because Kaylee Ray hit one, but look at this. <laughs> Mackenzie. A German suplex, number two. And it may be followed by the hat trick. Kaylee Ray turned inside out by it. A tri vector of German suplexes. Going for the quartet. And now, hang on, though. Kaylee Ray back to her feet. Mackenzie and Kaylee Ray. Not just a physical, but a mental war here. Two super kicks, Mackenzie doesn't go down. A third one. The champion is still up, for goodness sake. What is this from Mackenzie? Oh, reverse Hurricane Rana. Kaylee Ray lands on her head. But now a super kick right to the face. Both women are down. And another hugely competitive match here for the Defiant Women's title. Well, the championship hangs in the balance. Which women will leave? with that beautiful belt. Millie McKenzie has it. Kaylee Ray wants it. And of course, uh, if this is to be a double count out, if neither of these women can uh, answer the count of 10, then that's to McKenzie's advantage. She would leave here as champion in the event of a draw. Now, I'm not sure that's the way the first 21st century badass wants to end things tonight. Uh, she sure. wants to send a message that she is the best. Uh, in any case, it's academic now because Kaylee Ray has rolled outside, Mackenzie's on her feet. Mackenzie though, what's she doing here? Mackenzie's gonna go to the ropes and Mackenzie was gonna launch, but Kaylee Ray smashed her in the face to put on the brakes. Experience edge coming to the fore there from Kaylee Ray. Suckered Mackenzie in. Ooh, oh, spins her around. Elbow to the face of Mackenzie. I'll be very surprised if Millie Mackenzie still has a jaw after that. Oh, wait a minute now. Hang on now, what is this? Mackenzie launches Kaylee Ray, face and uh, chest first into the corner of the ring. 
Kelly Ray can't win the. Oh, oh no. Whoa, whoa. Mackenzie looking for a German suplex right near those crowd barriers. Kaylee swings round, a swinging drop kick right into the side of the head of the champion. And that's the athleticism of Ray. Shining hey. under the bright, bright lights here in Defiant Wrestling. Well, Kaylee Ray will use every part of the ring to her advantage. Was able to use the, uh, the ring post there to increase her momentum as she swung around at 270 degrees to smash Mackenzie right in the in the side of the head. This is ominous. Yeah, this is ominous. Kaylee Ray looking for goodness knows what, maybe a suplex, maybe a brain buster right on the apron here. Oh, this is this is not good for either woman out here on the ring apron. Referee Sean McLaughlin trying to get them back inside the ring. Mackenzie, what's she gonna do here? Mackenzie! A Canadian destroyer! Right on the ring, on the ring apron! Goodness me! The cover by Mackenzie to retain the title! And that'll do it! Millie Mackenzie, still the champ! Here is your winner! And still the fine wrestling women's champion, Millie Mackenzie! By including that triple threat match of lights out, that is now three times! Three times that Millie McKenzie has taken the best that Kaylee Ray has to offer, and on all three occasions, Millie McKenzie has walked out with the defiant women's championship. McKenzie always finds a way to get the job done. No different here on the road to no regrets. What is next for the first 21st century badass? McKenzie retains as we head towards no regrets. Mm-hmm. <clears throat>